The Zeus 100 up in North Texas was getting in a hunt as a winter cold front moved through, and I'm set up on a property right now where the property directly to the north is what I call a hog sanctuary. That is because I don't think they hunt much up there, and that is because all the hogs from this property seem to come from the property to the north. And right now it's got some hogs there in the corrals along with the horses. And I'm down here at the west gate, and I'm trying to figure out what I'm going to do, and it looks like Whatever I do from this side, all of my fields of fire are bad fields of fire because I'm going to shoot one of the horses or shoot one of the buildings, and that's not going to work out. So I head over to the east gate. I come in through the east gate with hopes of sneaking around up here to the east side and getting a safe shot out onto the west pasture through the corrals. And I think this is a great plan. I come down here to the east gate. I come in through the east gate, and I do my perfunctory scan. And what do you know? I've got a hog in this pasture as well. So this is going to be the hog that I decide to shoot. I'm going to take the one that I know where it is right now, and I'm going to shoot it now and see what happens with the other hogs over in the barnyard later. So I go ahead and shoot this hog, and then I move up and check on my hogs in the barnyard, and they're no longer there because they've moved out into the west pasture. So I figure that I need to go after them, only I can't go through all the gates in the barnyard. I have to go around north of the barn and then come around the backside. The hogs continue to move away, and I'm going to follow them and say continue to move, but because there's a really bright moon out right now, it's about a three-quarter moon, I'm going to use a tree to hide behind as I make my approach before finally taking my shot. And then the remaining hogs run into the hog sanctuary. So here I am on the east side. I've just come through the gate, and I'm doing my scan, and sure enough, there's a hog out in this pasture that wasn't here five minutes earlier when I came by. But there's one here now, and I'm going to try to shoot it with my... Monster Armory takes 15 multi-purpose carbine and 6.5 Grindel shooting for 300 DSST 123 grain ammunition. Looks like a decent sized boar. I don't see any livestock or any other hogs in this pasture. The problems I do have at this point are getting illuminated by cars driving by on the road and by the security lights on the landowner's house. The wind is in my favor which is great so I'm just going to camp out here and stay still and wait as the hog continues to come closer. No reason for me to move. I will let the hog do all the moving for me. Finally decided the hog's probably close enough. Take a couple cleansing breaths and wait for my time to take the shot. All right, here we go. He goes down and I stay on him for a bit. Make sure he's going to stay down. Quick scan of the rest of the pasture and I don't see any other hogs. So I'm going to go look for them. Now I've gotten up to the corral area and the hogs have moved off into the west pasture. So I go around the barn and come after them. I've used this tree in front of me to block their view because of the bright moon. The wind's in my favor still. So I'm in a pretty good position except for this tree being in my way. So I move a couple steps off to the side to get a better view of the hogs. It looks like I've got a large sow. And three smaller ones. What to do, what to do, what to do. Do I shoot the sow? Do I wait till the little ones line up? And maybe try for a twofer. They seem preoccupied. They don't know I'm here, so I'm in no hurry to make a decision. So do a quick scan of my surroundings. No other animals are on this side of the pasture. I do have a problem though. There is the brow of a ridge right here, which is something somebody pointed out in a previous video to be concerned about. And I definitely don't want to be shooting over that ridge top. The property to the north, the sanctuary property, is at a lower elevation right here. And so any of my shots that go over that ridge are going to go into the next property. And that's not going to be good. So I need to shoot a hog that is well below the crest of that ridge. And the obvious shot here is going to be the sow. Alright, here we go. She goes down. The hog's running in an arc and I lose my shot opportunities because of all the tree branches being in the way. She's staying down. I've got one hog that has stopped. So I try to move out from behind the branches. Maybe get a shot, and it's over the ridge, headed down, and then disappears into the hog sanctuary. 
Brass Catcher by Tactical Brass Recovery. The first hog of this series turned out to be a 200 pound boar. Nice set of cutters. And the sow came in at 160 pounds, and she was pregnant with seven on board. Carpe sus, my friends.